guys, I want you to dress your absolute best, but I don't want you to go poor in the process of looking for amazing clothes. Well, in today's video, guys, I have you covered with five cheap men's clothing websites to fit every guy's style needs. Let's get started. What's up everybody, George here from GP Lifestyle. And in today's video, guys, I'll be sharing with you my top five favorite cheap men's clothing websites. Also be sharing with you some items that I think these stores do exceptionally well that are also quite affordable. As always, gentlemen, there is a video summary with timestamps linked in the description if you guys want to skip to certain points. Let's get started. Number five on this list is a bit of a weird one because it is a store within a store and that is Top Man. Now Top Man's retail outlets here in Canada are usually within a Hudson's Bay or a Nordstrom, but their online store is its own separate store. And what I personally like about Top Man is that they were the go-to store for guys who needed a suit for the longest time ever. Now they've added more clothing, they sort of now became the precursor of Fashion Nova men, but I still think these guys do a lot of excellent affordable clothing. Now the variety is not huge at Top Man and the price is definitely a little bit more of the expensive ones on this list, but then again, this is an excellent starting point, especially if you want a suit. Now here on Top Man, you can find suits for under $200. You can find a whole jacket, and pants for less than $200. And I think this is an amazing starting point because here the quality is a step above H&M and a little bit better than Zara in my opinion. But then again, it is very difficult to find a good fitting suit under $200, maybe even under $400. And I think Top Man does this excellent. I love the color palettes that they use on their suits. And I personally think it's an excellent starting point when we talk about cheap clothing. Now, if you're not into the suits, that's okay. They have casual wear options out there and they have a little bit more street wear out there. I don't know so much about their casual line and their street wear line. I like some of the things that they're doing. They are a little bit more trendy, but overall you're gonna get a solid affordable piece no matter what you buy from them. Number four on this list, I talked about a lot on this channel recently, and that is Fashion Nova Men. Now, Fashion Nova Men has been taking Instagram by storm this past year with a lot of affordable, trendy streetwear out there. And I personally think Fashion Nova Men is a mixed bag when in terms of quality, in terms of actual style, when it comes to their clothing, because it's very linear. Although the number one thing that they do their absolute best is their jeans. Fashion Nova jeans is what originally made their women's line so popular and successful and this has carried over into their men's line now in my personal opinion I love their jeans they fit great I'm still picky on the buttons for being plastic and they are plastic they are a little hollow so uh, that opinion but then again their sheer variety and sheer affordability that is before the sales and discount codes that, that are just so many out there I personally think if you guys want a good pair of jeans a cheap pair of jeans that you don't have to get tailored and that fit great and are lightweight that you can wear in the colder months like i personally do and even in the summertime which i haven't given it a try here because summer in canada is like two weeks in july but i personally think they have a wide selection of jeans so no matter how distressed how funky or how simple you want they have it and again you can find jeans for like 25 to 50 dollars and that's not even counting how many discount codes and promotions are out there which makes it overall super affordable for getting a good pair of jeans now the rest of the style like their graphic tees and everything outside their jeans it's really up to you because for me i have my opinion which is extremely mixed so i can't give you guys a clear go to opinion for buying stuff other than jeans and fashion over men. And if you guys are enjoying this video so far, be sure to drop us a like and subscribe to their channel for two new men's lifestyle videos every single week, all designed to help you become the best version of yourself. Let's continue with the list. Number three on this list is the cheapest clothing store I ever shopped from. And it's not technically a clothing store, it's AliExpress. Now AliExpress is basically the Amazon of China where you can find everything from makeup to auto parts and even men's clothing, believe it or not. And when it comes to this, and when it comes to AliExpress, it is so enormous and there's so much out there that you're bound to find something that you'll like. And I can go ad nauseum of what AliExpress has, but it's literally everything that is made in China either goes to probably either AliExpress or Alibaba that you could probably find in a lot of Walmarts, Amazon, and even people who do like e-commerce drop drop shipping get a lot of their clothing and other things that they're selling from AliExpress. And when it comes to AliExpress, their clothing, there's so much out there that you're bound to find something you like. There's a lot of knockoffs out there because you are buying directly from China, but the sheer affordability makes up for it. A couple of drawbacks that there are is shipping time takes a while. You're looking at at least two and a half to three weeks. Every other clothing option on this list has a week 
or even sooner. AliExpress has it for two and a half weeks, which is, is really a pain in the ass in 2019. Another drawback here is their sizing because they follow an Asian, Asian size guide chart, which is different from everywhere outside because I think here you have to go two sizes up and they do measure it a little funky and a little differently. So it's going to vary from listing to listing on the site, which can make it a bit of a hassle when you want to buy a lot of clothes and do it fairly quickly. You guys spend a lot of time really going through the sizing chart. Which, like, when you have experience buying from other stores, especially one on this list, it's usually a go, go, go. Which here, it can be a pain in the ass to spend extra time reading every individual sizing. Another drawback is their quality. Now, their quality is a mixed bag, again, because there's so much out there that is going to vary so so much and i have this black data head that i had that i did on a denim jacket lookbook which if you're interested i'll have it linked up here somewhere and i got this hat for four dollars and i like the hat it does its job but it is just a lint magnet and it is just not the greatest quality the hat looks great don't get me wrong it's a stylish simple hat but the quality is not there so that might be a turn off for you uh, what i personally recommend getting from aliexpress is accessories like bracelets necklaces and even watches because they are dirt cheap like we're talking five to six dollars for a necklace and i have a couple of necklaces and bracelets that i got from aliexpress and they are no different from the ones that you would get in let's say an h m a zara a top man because you're buying it directly from the manufacturer so you ended up saving a lot more money because you could go buy the exact same bracelets at h m or zara and pay Pay 15 20 30 dollars for them or you can be like me and wait the extra week that shipping would take and get it for around three to four dollars i swear the shipping the express shipping costs even more which i personally think if you like accessories and you don't want to blow a whole budget on go with aliexpress because you'll find the exact same things that you can find in big retail chains for actually manufacturer level costs which I think is just amazing. And plus the sheer variety. Number two on this list I hold near and dear to my heart because this is my go-to store and that is ASOS. If you spend a minute learning about men's fashion and shopping online in general for clothes, you've probably heard of ASOS, the UK e-commerce giant when it comes to men's and women's clothing, grooming, and lifestyle in general. Now I personally love ASOS because of one reason and one reason only. There's something there for everyone. And what more can I say? If you're really budget oriented, like this video is meant for, you can go with their ASOS branded line and still get a whole lot of different clothing from crewnecks, trousers, joggers, a lot of the essentials they have in their ASOS branded clothing, which is fairly affordable. It's not the cheapest one, on this list but then again their quality is a step above like the sherpa denim jacket that i have i actually got that from asos and is their asos branded line that i got for 80 dollars haven't complained about the jacket ever i love the jacket it fits great it's two years old now and it's still kicking now, the black sonata that i got is not asos branded but then again it's just in that same price range and i gotta say it's it's great the quality is great i didn't overpay for it it's not some fancy designer brand it's some small uk company i'm not sure what's it called but then again, for $40, I got a nice turtleneck. For $80, I got a Sherpa denim jacket. And even if you're not so budget oriented, they have options that go from super generic ASOS line all the way up to like a Hugo Boss, Armani, Dior. Uh, they had Gucci there once, but I don't think they have Gucci there anymore. I know I saw it like two and a half, three years ago. And what I personally would recommend from ASOS is if you're looking to spice up some of your footwear is actually go with their loafers because I personally think ASOS, their footwear is underrated. A huge selection. Like what I personally like there is that you can get a pair of loafers for like $40. ASOS or whatever small company branded. Or if you're feeling bougie that day, you can go up to like Ted Baker pair of loafers for $300. That's what I personally like. That you have that option whether you can spend a little less get something, you know, not as rugged, but still as stylish, or you can spend it more, go up in quality and get something a little better, a little more panache, a little more bougie, a little more uh, flexing. And that's what I like because you have everything in one store and not just when it comes to clothing. Your grooming essentials are there and it is ultimately, you can get lost just scrolling through the vast amounts of clothing ASOS has. Number one on this list shouldn't surprise you at all and that is H&M, but online. Now, the reason I'm putting H&M number one when it comes to affordable clothing, it does seem a little cliche because this is everybody's go-to for cheap clothing. But the reason why they're online store is number one is because of two reasons sizing and variety now every time i go into h&m or one of my friends go or we all go 
Uh, finding your size can be nearly impossible since everybody shops at H&M and H&M is usually at high traffic areas, either downtown or a lot more, you know, just big malls in general. And the problem is you'll find something you like, but then they won't have your size. Then you have to make an effort to go to another H&M store, which you never know. By the time you get there, it could be gone. And I don't like that personally. I know it's not their fault, it's, I'm going to say it's the consumer's fault because they're getting all the good stuff. But when it comes to H&M Online, this is a place where you can go to and they have your sizing. I've never once found something that was sold out in my size H&M Online. And that's the reason why they're number one, is finding your size is so difficult when it comes to super affordable, trendy, stylish clothing. Another reason why H&M Online is number one is their sheer variety. You think when you walk into a store, there's a lot of clothes and a lot of different clothes. Well, just, just, just give it steroids and let it work out and eat nothing but protein shakes for a few months. And that's basically H&M Online. The sheer variety on that store, coupled with the ability to you to find your sizing, it just, it's hard to beat H&M prices where there's more stuff at the same price that you can find in your size. Like seriously, they're difficult to beat, although their quality is probably, it's not the best. It is really a mixed bag and they try to come out with their H&M premium line, but in my opinion, they just made it ever so slightly better because fabrics and textiles are not that expensive and just slapped a huge price tag on it to make it seem like, yo, we can do quality too. H&M can be a higher end brand, which I don't really buy into. But then again, this is for me the one-stop shop if you want everything in the style spectrum as well as to find stuff in your size. And there you guys have it. Those are my top five favorite cheap men's clothing websites. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel because it helps me sleep better at night. Thank you guys so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video. Peace.